<clears throat> Welcome to my room. I've been putting this off for a very long time because I have too many clothes. But today is the day. I'm going to try on everything. Everything. In my wardrobe and hopefully get rid of some stuff because I find myself standing really weird. I find myself wearing the same stuff every day or putting something new on and hating it. So why does it go back in your wardrobe? Get rid of it. So enjoy watching me try on everything in my wardrobe starting off like this. First up, dresses. Here is all of my dresses. Oh, dresses and jumpsuits. Jumpsuits, dresses, sleeves, long, you know. Let's begin. Do you like it? Never worn. Brand new. I know I love this one. I think we keep. I so put this in the alterations pile. This is probably not gonna fit me. But we'll try. Well, I cannot bend, but. <clears throat> brand new although it's five years ago brand new it's very cute it does not fit over my butt so somebody gets a super cute dress also I apologize for this it's something wrong with me I don't know what it is I need to discuss in a different dress because this one does not. But. I mean, she cute. But I also don't go to clubs, so. Bye. Another secret one. So, what I was trying to say is it. Don't know what this is. It's gross, but I'm gonna get it out there because I know someone will comment on it. I'm going to see a dermatologist. It's not contagious, it's just gross. But we're all human. Another sequin dress. She cute. She was five dollars from the op shop. This 
is a Leo piece. Is that weird? You can't go wrong with a plain black velvet dress. This is not plain, it is detailed. Okay. The other one can go. Bye. Bye bye. Bye. Keep. dress is not fun to put on. I feel like long. This is pretty much just to wear under other things. Wow! I like these because it covers your pudge. And like this one, which will definitely not. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I think I might need to just do. Trying on all my new dresses. Oh, it's very see through. What if I did new? Oh god. We're gonna keep her anyway. <clears throat> yes, it's the same. Yes, it's new. Yes, I have not worn it. I think this one is smaller. But I also like it. And it's see through? Also see through, but it's summer dress. So we will keep her. So I complain about being chunky and then eat garlic bread and pizza. But you know what? Who cares? Mm -hmm. mm. Tomino's vegan pizzas are expensive but delicious. This may be why I cannot fit into everything. But it's okay. 
You do you. It's been two hours. I had a food break, a coffee break. Let's continue. I'm pretty sure this shrunk in the wash. It's very short. I need another one. This one can go in the maybe. I like it. Hmm. Oh, this one is slightly covered in cat hair. But I'm just pretend like it's fine. I bought this one size too big and figured she'll be right. I'm not sure if that looks weird. But it's comfy, so I don't care. Bye. So this will be in the tailored pile. To be tailored. This is one I made from a cute vintage pattern. And I have no boobs. This one I normally wear with a t-shirt or a jumper because well you know but fun stuff I think this can probably go. It's a cute idea. I'm gonna put it in the altar pile because I feel like I can make something useful. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
through. Doesn't matter. Nude underwear can fix that. I love this one, but you have to do all the buttons up. So I can already tell you I'm going to put it in the alterations pile. Put a zip in this bitch. universally flattering. This is what we're left with and I'm undecided on this because it's so comfy but and, and this because it's so short and this because it's just not my style anymore. Slash I don't think it ever was my style it was for work. Um so <laughs> one two three four five things five things we're getting rid of. <laughs> Jackets, coats, one of my vices, outerwear. But wait, there's more. Just don't know if this is an appropriate outfit to try on chaka. The lighting's kind of turned to shit as well because it is now dark. It is missing a button. It's fine. Nobody needs to know. I have a little bit of my jacket. I have a lot of this bees. I do want to, because it has pockets, oh, and bottle tops, pockets, and this is the pocket, but I'm actually going to sew that so I can, so let's put this in the alterations pile. Basically, everything is going to keep. Bye here. Mm. So sad outside. Meh. This bad boy, I actually got rid of, and then a friend didn't want it anymore. 
and I wanted it back. I also have this in black, but it's in the other room because I have to do something to it. And I have this funky. Also, I don't think I've mentioned this entire time. We do not have door handles and the door is not painted. This is from Depop and I really like it, but it's too small for me. Like maybe I could get away with it, but I'm just like, <laughs> I think she gotta go. Before she even was cool. Let's brush. I love this one. So soft. She's a little sad and rusty, but I can do this one handed. But anyway. Yeah. I think we have to keep this. This is so cute. guys coat because the pockets are huge another cool vintage piece cute nobody knows but it's a size 16 I don't care. We want an inside pocket. This is cute. Miller's size 20. Another option I find now, which is big W, size 14. <laughs> oh, I thought it was a clicky pen. This is a fun one. Cute. 
cute little piping details, pockets, which is reversible. Cinematics kind of failed. Yeah. I mean. if you don't have other stuff underneath it. Apparently I needed a list for this. Apparently I don't empty my pockets. This is one of my favorite op shop finds. So cute. I did at one point have a belt, but I did not have a belt. What? Are you kidding? So, the buttons are here, and if you do it up like this, well, that doesn't make sense. But, this is luxurious. You're not locked out. You're just shut so that I can actually see. We don't have to do that. Sorry, what do you want? No, I want to have a sauce. I'm not getting rid of any jackets. I just... I love them. Mm. Thanks. You're a gem. This was from the same friend that gave me the black one. And I have not worn it. But... She cute. This used to uh, attach here, but I took the buttons off because you could see. And yeah, so. Uh. <coughs> oh, this is very old. So cute though. My mum bought this jacket when I was a shitty teenager. And she bought it up and I was like, and I kept it. And now I love it. What was past me thinking? Like, look at the, ah, oh, so cute. There's more on the floor. I don't think I'm gonna get rid of any jackets but he's so cute look at this little guy keep this one is pretty special <sighs> Thank you. 
This is a cool one. It has its innards. Or you can just have a green hockey and a rack. Yes. Beautiful. So, multi seasonal. And then you put this on the inside, it zips up, it zips in, and then you have a luxurious, bloody warm coat. I'm not gonna zip it and clip it because I can't be bothered. But you get the idea. You zip it. Look at that. Boom. Or boom. And this is a very old but well loved coat. Also with a giant hood. Are you hungry? Is it dinner time? And I don't really like being picked up, but come here. Oh, meow, meow. oh. hello. This you. Do you want to call comfy? Pop you on the bed. There you go. Cardigan. Oh, yes. She's cute. She's comfy. This. Oh, this is a box from Miller's. Miller's. Extra large. Miller's. A medium. And I froth this one. So cute. Like. What. Is this. This is so cute too. I think this must have been handmade. So cute. And if you want, I'm like obsessed with oversized stuff. Plus it hides my manky hand. Or you could cut it. But it's so cute. A beautiful op shop find. A vintage piece too. Which I would wear as a jacket approach. Rather than a dress. But it's supposed to be done up like this. I think it was like a fancy, you know, but I would just wear it. Cash as Liz Jordan. And I think it was supposed to be like a dress or something to wear over a dress, but how killed. But I just lift it open, tie the tie back like so. And then have a very cute little kimono y throw thing. I need to vacuum because there's fluff everywhere. Speaking of kimonos, can you see what it is? I made this one. So, it's got fancy French seams. Mm, but it's lots of fun. This has almost been gotten rid of a couple of times, but I think with the right outfit. This is technically loungewear, pajamas. But. Now, this was actually a two-piece and came with the dress, and I'm kind of sad that I split it, but... What? Are you kidding me? Mama! Two. I think half my wardrobe is thrifted. What? Look at the shoulder. Oh, 
obviously doesn't go with this fit, but you know. Three more! It's flashing at me. It's saying I'm about to die. This came with matching pants and it's so cool. Why hello there. It's been about six months since you saw that last footage of the blazer cut off and my battery died. And I don't know why it's taken me this long for me to film an outro. But anywho, I hope you enjoyed my video. Uh, if you're struggling to get rid of things, I highly recommend filming yourself because in the mirror you might think you look really good, but the video will show you maybe that that piece needs to go. You might be wondering what I'm going to do with all this stuff that I'm getting rid of. And I'm, although I didn't really show you entirety, uh, but I have a whole wardrobe of stuff and boxes of clothes. You, normally I'd sell them at markets, uh, but can't really do that at the moment. So next best thing is Depop, Facebook Marketplace or clothing swap groups. Um, it is a little bit of time to take photos and things, but I think it's still good to do because you know that people are going to actually want your items. Sometimes the op shops do get overwhelmed with things, so of course you can donate it. Um, just make sure that you check through your stuff and it's actually good quality and it's not ratty and tatty and gross. Um, but next video, next series, next series, next part of this is tops and pants and skirts and jumpers and knits so stick around for that next one and i will see you then bye